Yeah, it has been years. Now that I've 999, let's go. We got one more to go, actually. I'm going to have to focus here. But yes, it has been years. It's been three years uh, since I actually started YouTube. I did. I made my channel before that because I just wanted to like be able to comment on people's videos and stuff like that. But then when I actually made the videos, um, it was like 2020. And then I got the screen recording. So this is going to be good. Got one more subscriber to go. 1,000, let's go! Hell yeah! That is amazing, look at that. Actually, I got a screenshot that. Woo! We are back, sorry guys, I had to screenshot that. 1,000 subscribers, let's go! I'm talking to the camera over here because that is freaking exciting. 1,001, there we go, keep it going guys. Um, yeah, that's amazing. Thank you guys. I appreciate you guys. Subscribe and then enjoy it and stuff like that. <laughs> Get out. <laughs> Come on in. My dad is something else, man. Look what he is dressed up in. <laughs> he is dressed. <laughs> Thank you, dad. <laughs> he is something else. That is crazy. I just got to 1,000 subscribers on YouTube. That's a lot. <laughs> hey, Mom. Job, Thank you, Mom. <laughs> we got there. I know you will. Testing, testing, one, two, three. I hope it's good. Holy shit. Holy shit. We just reached 1,000 subscribers on YouTube, guys. <laughs> uh, I did not. I did not think that it would happen this year. I was at like 960 something. And I'm thinking, oh man, we're just gonna end the year, you know, with 40 to go and whatever like that. And I wasn't prepared to get a bunch of bigger videos out there. So I was like, okay, well that's enough. Uh, that's enough posting for this year. Um, and then last night and yesterday, I just kind of was like, you know what? Just for fun, I'm gonna post this on my Instagram just recycled content from last year's Christmas special because Christmas, you know, I'm, I'm very big into Christmas as you can see, Feliz Navidad, <laughs> but I wanted to post something. So I was like, okay, let me just scramble something together. Made a Instagram reel. And then I was like, you know what? Let's just see how it does on YouTube. And I posted about four of them and they all got a few subscribers each and it started growing a bit and stuff like that and we were around 970 something last night and then i decided to take the video that i took or that i recorded and posted the other day and put it up as a reel again the grinch gang thing people love the grinch you know and um it got 24 subscribers and that pushed it all the way to this morning because last night I went to bed and it was at 9.83. This morning I woke up it was 9.96 and I was like, oh my God, it's coming, you know? <laughs> so then I set up all these cameras, did the Instagram live and we got to 1,000 subscribers. It has been a long journey since the first video that we did back in 2020. Um, and that video inspired me to continue you know just taking the chance to record to do something um do something out of my comfort zone and stuff like that and here we are <laughs> 1,000 subscribers later and it's just amazing to me that i was able to progress in a bunch of these skills one computer work i back then I did a bunch of computer stuff with architecture, but I felt incompetent with a bunch of the different things. Um, but editing, you know, it forces you to learn to be better with computers. Second thing, to be better with talking to a camera. Like, back then I wasn't able to do nearly as much with like the different skill sets that you need to record on camera and be conveying and entertaining and stuff like that. Now, I still have a hard time, and so does every YouTuber, apparently, 
<laughs> they claim this, but we have a hard time being like just quick witted with it or just on the spot perfect every time. You're not going to be perfect every time. And that's something that you have to learn and deal with as you grow through whatever you're doing. You're not going to be perfect every time. No video of mine is going to be perfect every time. Now, but there is getting better and there is progression and that is why we're at 1,000 subscribers today. There was a lot of different tests, a lot of different experiments that I had to go through. I posted consistently for a while, three videos a week. Um, now they weren't the best quality of videos to my standard now, uh, which is why I'm trying to go with bigger ideas now and post once a week. Uh, but it just takes a lot more time to edit these bigger videos. I have so much more footage that I have to cut down and all that type of stuff and make like different effects, different texts. There's so much. <laughs> um, but this year was extremely hard because I went through a whole phase of creator burnout. More so just editing burnout, honestly, because I was filming a lot during that time, but I, I had a very hard time editing and catching up and keeping up. And now we're still in the phase of catching up, but we're making big progress and some big videos that are lining up for the new year, and I'm excited. These videos have the potential to go viral, so I'm taking extra, extra perfect time, or not perfect time, but extra time to make sure they're really good so that people enjoy it. And in turn, they subscribe. The subscriber count is not the most important thing. It's just something that's motivating, you know? Something that helps. It's a little boost. And having that thousand subscribers now is something that that will inspire me and push me to keep going uh, even harder, to keep going even harder. Again, thank you guys. It's been a, a lot. <laughs> it's been a hard, hard goal to reach, but we finally did it. Like and subscribe. I'll see you guys next year. Peace.